Hi everyone, welcome to your dev guide. So in this video, we will be seeing another coding interview questions. So mostly this question asked in the interview, the depend upon the interview experience. So the question is that so input array will be given to you, and uh, they will ask you to count the number. So the number, how many times it get occurrences over there? If you see two is high times, so it, it should show like this two high times, and then nine one time, five three times, and the four is one time so this is how they would expect you to do so let's get started how to do this and before going to start please make sure you subscribe subscribe the okay. so for this we will do one thing so this array we have so on the other and now we have to create output as an object okay so for this we have to create an object so it can hold the pro the value and the count of it so we can do for the reason const result equal to blank so now we can do one thing so we have to okay let's see but what we have to do so we need loop then we need uh index and the account of it so we have to push like this so the result uh, result of index okay like this if it is already there present then plus plus okay. else assign one okay Assign it to one. Okay, so this is just for information. So, what we have to do here? So, that is why I have written. So, let me create it with a for loop. For foreign as well. Can use for const for of that we can use for of. So, now we have this array. We have this iterator. Okay. Now, what we have to do, we have to check the value is present or not like that. So, we can do what to RES or I. Okay. We'll assign this to here. If it is present over there, now we have to do this things now what we can do various on a level over there then we can assign this value to x plus one so we will implement it our assign one so we do this thing else we directly assign one so this is how it will get updated over here. So now, so this is RES will be created over here. So let's see how it's okay. So this is how it get executed. So output should be two five times, four one time, five three times, and nine. So let me show you how it is getting executed over here. Define this. Okay. We'll put a debugger over here and we can debug that. So how it is working over here? Put debugger over here and if I rerun this. Okay. Now if you see this is blank. Okay. So the object is blank now. So what we are doing over here. So if I go next, then it would be array we have, then res don't have. Okay. So it came first index. Okay. So it was not present in that case. Now i is again coming. So what will happen over here? It will check this index is present or not there. Let, let me show you there. Okay. Now we come to inside this. So index is one. So one means this one will take like five. So five is present here or not. If it is present, then it will come here to increment that so this is how it getting worked okay so if you see two now count if i do like this then you can see two so this is how it is getting executed and i have one question for you guys as well so same same kind of question i have let me show you that as well 
so this is another input for the question so what they would expect to you so they will give you this array and ask you to count the occurrences of this so two is three time over here so if you give seven or eight or anything so depend upon that you have to count this so what would you prefer to do this so i have the one way to we can use the reduce and if you don't have that built-in functionality to you so how can you do this so this is the homework for you guys